Warning, this game is not recommended for children under the age of 18. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. It's another episode of GTA 5, everybody's favorite game. And as usual, it starts with us jacking a ride. So, let's cut to the pre-made stuff, roll the footage, and crack on with it. Before we begin this video, make sure you hit that like button. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and be sure to hit the bell icon so you can stay notified for when the next video comes out. Make sure you have all of the notifications on and let's get started. Your ride is mine. No, it's not. Never mind. Okay. What the fuck? Okay. Your Give ride is mine. Right <gasps> Alrighty, so we got the ride, and we're playing as uh, Franklin today. And I'm going to go do the Lester mission because Lester has something, something for me. Uh, first, I need to lose these cops. I gotta say, this, uh, for an SUV, this has pretty good handling. So, I think we're just gonna take a shortcut through the movie theater. Don't matter if I do. Like so. And, uh,. Go down to the pier where the mission is at, and I really gotta lose these cops before I start this mission. But, um... I think I'll be able to lose them here soon. <clears throat> so, off camera, I did a little, uh... buying spree. Um, Lester... Not Lester. Uh... Franklin got this garage right here. Uh, Trevor got a slip right here. Um, and Trevor also got a garage somewhere up here. Somewhere. Um, yeah, I was, I was spending some money and Michael just doesn't have any money. We're gonna we're gonna take a drive down here if I can. I lost the cops, you die. And we're gonna we're gonna go right into this thing right there and start the mission. Bada bing, bada boom. <coughs> What's up, man? Sit down and face forward. Now, I don't have a lot of time. I know you need money. Did Michael tell you about Life Invader? Oh, shit. Y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I don't know, homie. I mean, yeah, the dude I source worked to child slaves. Then stole and sold everybody's private information. And even ripped his own friend's ideas off and walked around like the Messiah while doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today, when a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fools' heads off just as much as the next psychotic asshole. But I just don't look at the shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fools' heads, it's assholes' heads. And not just heads, you know, trashing cars or planning lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, we'll fix the market in our favor and we'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> Shit, okay, cool. Right, so, you heard of Mollus? 
Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new mollus, sort of a super mollus, and it's called Priapolds, and it's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA, and he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart attacks. Damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, it does. Now, Mr. Greedy Lowry is staying at the Von Krastenberg Hotel in Richmond, of course, he'll be well protected, but if he goes away, then America goes back to using mollusks, and Beta Pharmaceuticals gets a big bump in the price of their stock. Damn, man. All right. Fuck it. I got you. I thought that you would. Now, consider using a sniper rifle or sticky bombs. You know, whatever. Do it your way, however you want. I'm going to make the investment. We don't speak about this or anything. Now walk away, and I'll stay here till you're gone. Alrighty, so we apparently have to do an assassination. Do I have. I do have a sniper rifle. I'm better than what I thought. Okay, so we're gonna head on over to that hotel and see what we gotta do. Yeah, <laughs> pulling in the handicap spot. Guards have arrived to pick up the target from the hotel. He is expected to leave very soon. Plan the attack quickly and find a location with a good vantage point of the hotel. Okay. There we go. I lost the door. Alright, so we're just gonna go lose the cops right now. We assassinated the target. Everything is Gucci once I lose these freaking cops. Oh, I gotta do some slick stuff right here to lose this guy. There we go. We're just gonna go in that hole. A little hidey hole right there. Alright, it's gonna be a good old grand time. We're gonna flip the car and everything's gonna be fantastic. Alright, now we wait. We'll be back as soon as we lose the cops. And we're back. <laughs> Alright, we got a we got a gold for that one. Hey, it's done. I know. Good work. Alright, well she. Let me know about the next thing. We'll do, uh, but before that, I've got to tell you something. Our investment portfolio is getting a little, uh, successful, so I figured we needed some tangible assets and new property, so we bought a house in the Vinewood Hills. Yeah, sure, man, whatever. You know best about this shit. And we needed someone to live there you know, for tax purposes, so some guys are moving your stuff in. Oh, shit! Meaning I don't have to live with my crazy-ass aunt no more? Man, I don't know what the fuck to say, dawg. Don't say anything, especially if a man in a suit comes to the door. Ah, I'm joking. That probably isn't gonna happen. It's yours. Enjoy it. Three six seven one Wispy Mound Drive. Sweet. We got a new. We got a new safe house, and we're gonna go check it out. Uh, I just need a new vehicle. Uh, cause this is terrible. Right now. So we'll be back once we get a new vehicle. All right, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go check out that house. As soon as I get off this highway. <laughs> like so. Oh, there's there's a wall there. Not to worry. We got a little half a wall there. And we got a big old truck that, of course, can't get over. Love it. 
fantastic. You, why? There we go. And I'm right into a tree. Okay, that's fantastic. Alrighty, so let's go check out that house. And we'll be back as soon as we get there. Yo, is that our crib? Ah, yeah. That is nice. Yeah, that is that is pretty sick. That is pretty sick. That's awesome. <laughs> Let's go check it out. Ah, uh, yeah. Hey, you still owe me from that one time. Man, this is a pretty sick house. I like it. <clears throat> Got a pool and everything. Nice balcony. Yo. Got a nice view of the city. Yeah, this is it's pretty sick. Oh look, we got a med pack and I'm going to automatically use it. Thank you very much. Some, some moving boxes. Yo. This is nice. Pretty sick. wonder when the moving boxes are going to, you know, move out. What's this? <clears throat> ah, the front door. Ah, yeah. What's down here? I got a... Oh! Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I can't get him... Can't get in that my, my certain rooms are locked off in my own friggin' house. Oh yeah. Hey look, another med pack. Damn. What's in here? Nothing. Hey look, I got a suitcase. I can't move anything. Anything in here? No. What about here? What are you doing? Go this way. Okay, I can't go there. But this is this is cool. We got a nice little accent wall there with some paintings and stuff. This is actually a pretty sweet crib. Got a little conversation den over here. And a telescope. And I'm stuck. <clears throat> Does the telescope work? <clears throat> ah, yeah. It's a little, a little dirty. Cool. It works. That is, that is a window, not a door. There is a door around here somewhere. Ah, right here. Alrighty, let's go, let's go down a floor and check out down there. Another turd chop? Oh, I gotta school your ass. Hey, we got chop. What's in here? Oh yeah, hot tub time. <laughs> Got a nice grill. 
and a pool. Don't mind if I do. Ha ha ha. Ah yeah. This is the good life. And I think that may be the title of this video, The Good Life. Alrighty, so... Let's... Let's go do another mission as Franklin. Let's see what we got. We got uh, two Strangers and Freaks and another Lester mission. So, let's just go with the Lester mission right here. Actually, before we do that, let's... Let's go with this one because it is a lot closer. Uh, it's another Strangers and Freaks mission. So we're just going to jack a vehicle and get cracking on it. So we'll be back. And now is actually a good time to showcase all my other cars that I have in here. Uh, because I got, a, I got a few. At least one. That I know of. Oh yeah, got a few. So, you obviously know about that one. This one, this one I saw, and it's highly, highly modified, very fast, very responsive, and I don't know, I just stumbled upon it. It was parked outside of a, a building in in the hills. And then this one, I jacked off some dude. Uh, and these, these two I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna really modify, but that, that one, this one looks like a Mustang, by the way. This one, it needs, it needs a different color. There's no two ways about it, it needs a different color. And I got enough room right here for one more vehicle. So that's pretty sweet. And then I got the motorcycle and the default car at the house, and then that pickup truck at the house. Uh, I had another uh, vehicle at the aunt's house, which let me see if I can still access the garage over there, because I did actually have a vehicle in there. Alright, so we're going to do the Strangers and Freaks mission down here. Oh, so I take no it I job. can count on your attendance, friend. Huh? At the smoke in. We're what? Yeah. We're gonna bring down the government by smoking weed together in a public place. It's very Oh uh, not this again. I'm prepared to be a martyr, friend. Are you? <clears throat> Shit, if being a martyr means to smoke good weed, for sure. Would you like a little warm up? You know, before you go and collect the supplies? Before I what? You no. Know. Get the supplies. Can't have a smoke in without smoke. You know, cerebral stuff that's gonna get the people up off their feet protesting. Man, I don't know. It sounds kind of bullshit to me. We're gonna crush them with our resolve. Here. <clears throat> uh, <clears throat> not this freaking mission again. I've seen this many times. Hmm. Just a mellow, sophisticated high. Man, this seems a little dry. Can't you see the aliens? Man, what else are you taking? Man, this shit is garbage. Anyway, just get the stuff. It's a revolution, and then call me. Crazy motherfucker. Oh. San Andreas needs you. I I'll text you where the stuff is. Well, that was easier than expected. Um, <laughs> okay, then. Um, weird. I expected to do the the monsters thing and Franklin didn't actually have a reaction to it. I'm quite surprised. So let's head on over to the the safe house. 
grab the motorcycle and uh, head on over to that other Strangers and Freaks mission before we do the Lester mission. So, let me ask you this. How are you guys liking the uh, series so far? You guys want to see a lot more? It's a pretty, pretty fun game. You have no idea, okay? My last video recording session was last night. I did 11 videos back to back. Uh, it's not really that much of a secret or a surprise when I say I like to pre-record the videos. Only because it allows me to get more uploads because the video is already done. What's this? Little random event mission. Over here. Give me your fucking money now! Don't shoot! I'm, I'm just a lowly agent. I playing here. Hand it over. I didn't do anything to you, please! Do you want to die over this, bitch? No, what? I owe you big. I can get you Corker's ticket. Don't mind if I do. That was easy. That poor eyed. Glad it's not mine. <laughs> Would you come on, Dean? I don't have any headlights. Nice try. Okay, so apparently the mission is not over yet. Uh, I just need to go home and get the motorcycle. And then we can go ahead and do that thing for Barry to complete that mission. I just want to test a theory right now. Does it respawn at the house? All right, so we're gonna we're gonna open up. Ooh, that's a nice helmet. All right, so we're gonna go pick up the supplies from somewhere. Uh, there and there. Okay. Let's get right to it. <clears throat> All right, so he marked it on. He marked it on the map in two different uh, circle areas, right there and there. Uh, there's really nothing up here. There is a Strangers and Freaks mission right there. Uh, All right, we're just gonna head on down that way. I think I'm going to take a shortcut. I'm hoping this is a shortcut. Ah, oh, it's a stun jump. Two. Alright. Didn't expect that. It is. Ah, we found it. It is right there. Alrighty. So we got one. Come on, start. This guy fucking asshole. Uh. I don't want to start. Here's Whoa! Who changed my ringtone? 
Hey, look, man, that car in La Poeta is a fucking hoopty. The engine is fucking shot, man. I'm gonna grab a stash and get the fuck out of here. No, no, it could be a trap, and I need that car. The movement depends on it. You'll have to push it or something. Are you out of your damn mind? Hey, do it for your stage. Do it for freedom. Do it for nature. Ignite the fight. You been igniting the fight too motherfucking much, dawg. I just so happened to notice this tow truck over here on the way in. Alrighty, and we are on our way. We finally found it. Thank you, Google. Alrighty, and we're here at Barry's apartment with the stash club. Get your ass down here. I'm outside with this junker you made me drag across town. Look, just leave it there. I can't come out now. The satellites! I mean, they're scanning our brains and tracking our heartbeats through the internet. Go now while you still can. Man, I'm wasting my fucking time. No, you're a hero, a green warrior. We're changing lives. Alrighty, and since that one's done, we got... We got one more to go. Hey, somebody, please! My friend is hurt. Someone, do something, please! Okay, don't. You. You are stupid. You know that. You really are. You didn't think I was heavily armed? Are you kidding me? <laughs> See, the problem with the problem with stuff like that is, um, if you if you pull out the gun too soon, all right, it fails the mission because they're like, yeah, I don't need that kind of help. Um. Whereas if you pull it out at the right time, ooh, this is this one's even better. If you pull it out at the right time, i.e., like I did, and after they started shooting, uh, then you know you're gonna you're gonna pass the mission and stuff. So we're gonna we're gonna go head on over to the little search area thing just to see what's up with it. Um. I really don't think there's a secondary vehicle. I think that was the only one. Uh, <clears throat> but I'm not sure. We'll, we'll see when we get there, though. Should probably be more than one of these. Who is this? The fool running around after me. I oh, found cops. the truck you wanted. Oh, good, good. That is that is a cop car. Oh, now hurry! I need it in Vespucci in the next couple of hours. And watch yourself. I hear the cops have been snooping around over there. That that's. That's a problem. Okay, so there actually is a secondary vehicle. Um, and this one was a lot easier. And... I... I gotta take these guys out. Because... I've... I've seen them.
There we go. And I got a problem. Okay. <clears throat> Shit, motherfuckers had eyes on the plate. Oh. Hey, this is actually a pretty nice trip. Come on, come on. How fucking slow is this thing? So this is pretty freaking thrilling, right? Man, there's got to be a better way to get weed legalized than this bullshit. Yeah, ain't that the truth? I reached the end of the line. Okay, so we're gonna go back this way, and I need to find like a tunnel or something. Man, fuck, I'm never gonna lose these assholes. Um, trapped like crap. This is, this is big problem. Big, big problem. Uh, there's nowhere for me to friggin' lose these cops. And it's not like, and I'm running out of time, you know? It's not like I have a friggin' tunnel readily available that I can just duck down and potentially lose the cops. There is literally nowhere for me to go. Ah, train tunnel. Don't mind if I do. Who's gonna Damn, go I gotta here? get the fuck on. All right, there we go. There we go. And I'm out of friggin' time. <clears throat> oh, she. Don't tell me you're coming down the tunnel. You are coming down the tunnel. Are you kidding me? Man, right. I did not need that shit. This fucking smoke in, it better be working. All right, I finally lost the cops. But I failed the mission because I'm out of time. <clears throat> so there is a very, very limited time frame on this mission. Let's try it again. Shit, motherfuckers had eyes on the plate. This don't make no fucking sense. And didn't plan on getting stuck. Motherfuckers had eyes on the plate. Right here. All right. I'm going wrong. I need to be down here. Come on, come on. 
How fucking slow is this thing? Uh, at least I don't have a chopper on me right now. That's that's pretty good. So it was a problem because I I used the grenade launcher to kill the cop. And so I got an extra star that I shouldn't have had. Um, Man, that's gotta be whereas a if I do it the right way, just shit. hop in and start driving and get caught anyway, because I'm going to get screwed anyway. It only gives me a two star, which means I don't have a chopper, which means I can take the surface streets and not have to worry about it. Which means it's going to be faster to do it that way. And I could just use the speed and get rid of them, and it's going to be so much faster to get rid of them, too. So. I need to go this way anyway. This will work. Which is perfect because we still have plenty of time. We're going to get there and still have time left over. Because that's the smart way to do it. Now, I'm not sure how much time we're gonna have left, but it's looking like a good solid minute because I see his apartment Look out, man. right now. Okay, so we're not going to have a full solid minute, but we are going to have a good couple seconds. That truck likes to get stuck. That is a freaking crappy truck. Now, is that my pizza? Hell no, fool, it's me. I'm here. Oh, well done. Hey, a true crusader for civil liberties. <laughs> uh, were you follow? Follow? Man, that's an understatement. But look, don't trip out. We good. Now look, man, won't you come down and check this? I got shit to do, man. Yeah, well, I'll send someone when I know it's clear, okay? Can't be too careful, and I'm dealing with some composting issues. <laughs> this is a bad burrito. Shit, whatever, man. But that's more information than I need. <laughs> yeah, it is. Alright, guys. That's where we are going to leave things right now. Uh, it's been, it's been one crazy mission. Um, anywho, I hope you're enjoying the series as much as I am making it, and we will see you on the next one. Until next time, bye. Have you ever wanted to send me fan mail but wasn't sure where to send it? Well, look no further than this video. I got a P.O. box, and the address is on screen now. Plus, if you want me to check out your Minecraft world on either the Java edition or the Bedrock edition, you can send it to me via a flash drive. I'll be checking it out on my next video. I can't wait to see what you all send me. Hey guys, don't forget to check out my Discord and other social media sites. It's a great way to connect with me. Also, if you like the content and you want to help support the channel, head on over to my Patreon and become a patron today. For just $3 a month, you get patron-only updates and your name added to the patrons list in my next video. For just a little bit more, at $6 a month, you get early access to videos before I make them public. Finally, for just $9 a month, you get to hear your name during a shout-out for every month you are a patron in this tier. Plus, the best part is, the higher tiers get every benefit from the lower ones. What are you waiting for? Become a patron today. All of those links will be down in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did making it. If you did enjoy it and you would like to see even more videos, click on the cards on the screen right now. Or you can head on back to my channel for even more videos. I hope you guys are staying fabulous and I will see you on the next one. Until next time, bye.